this is the applicability of Christelus central place theory central place theory was given by Walter Christler in 1933 CPT in urban geography in is one of the most appreciate, appreciated theory which tries to explain the special arrangements and distribution of human settlements and their numbers based on population and distance from another human settlements. So it is mainly city, large circle, then towns, then market town, market town, then village. Then boundary. Christopher's assumption. Christopher's assumption. assumption to focus on the economic aspects on of his history, of his theory, Christopher had to create a set of assumptions. He decided to, for example, in the countryside, in the areas he was studying, would be flat, so no barriers would exist. It would impede people's movement across it. In addition, two assumptions were made about human behavior. Kestler stated that humans uh, will always purchase goods from the closest place that offers the goods whenever demand for a certain good is high, it will be offered in close proximity to the population. When demand drops, demand drops, so too does the availability of the good, central place uh, size and species. Within the central place system, there are five sizes of communities. A hamlet is the smallest and is the and is the rural community, which is too small to be considered a village. Cape Door said, Cape Door said, population 1200, located in Canada's Unabhat territory is an example of a hamlet. The rank order of such central place is hamlet, village, town, city, regional capitals. Thank you.